Hello, hello, hello. Mike Test, how's everyone doing? Welcome. Welcome to the stream. I am at long last to jumping into Helldivers 2 uh, as part of a sponsored stream, thanks to Sony. And uh, hey, you know what? I was looking forward to this because I was one of the one of the people, one of the early adopters of the Helldivers. <laughs> um, I don't know, was it like 10 years ago? It was, it was some time ago that the first game came out. The top-down iteration, nine years ago, a little over nine years ago. What year was this thing published? I'm gonna blast through my speakers here. Uh, 20, okay, 2015. March in 2015, it looks like it's my oldest Helldivers video, the top-down version. Used to play with my mates, had a great time. And, uh, man. This sequel popping off. <laughs> it's unbelievable. It's crazy. I mean, I'd love to, I'd love to see it. Uh, love to see it. I've been inundated with some, uh, other games in the past few weeks, but... I think we're good here. Uh, oh, just one second, chat. I just have to change something. We'll give it a second anyways, people to come on in, and then we'll jump in and start liberating for democracy. For Super Earth. <laughs> I do want to check quickly. Oh, Nightbot is doing it? Dude, what is Nightbot doing? <laughs> All right, uh, yeah, let's do it. Here we go. So we're just gonna play for some Helldivers, yeah? You heard of this? Helldiver. The Super Destroyer is ready for your next mission. Uh, and if you guys are interested in checking out the game, of course, give that link a look down below. All right, so this area is fully liberated. I will go to the non-liberated area and do a mission. Uh, I do want to make sure I'm at least open people can uh join it's gonna work do that ply and jump in it's quick play i guess i mean can i just start a mission right and then if someone wants to join they can join fresh meat exactly <laughs> You know what's so funny? So, cause like I said, I played the I played the first Hell Divers, and um, I think right away they had stuff like the they had the mech suits available, right? The whatever it's called, the Patriot Liberator thing. I don't know. I'll, I'll find out the exact name when I hop in, cause we have access to it since they just released it here. But I guess I just assumed they were gonna have like everything right from. Oh my God, there's a lot here. There's the extraction zone. Maybe I land by the extraction zone and then just push out. Cause my mate told me I want to clear everything on the map, right? If you want to get like uh, max rewards for a mission, you want to go and clear all the eggs, get all the heat maps taken care of or whatever. I can deploy an SOS as well. Right, right, right. Clear everything. Probably land in the red zone. That's a hot spot. Wi-Fi probably. You <laughs> Are you trying to set me up for failure? Guy had me land right in front, right in the middle of everybody. Get absolutely demolished. I assume people can. Can people join without me setting up a an SOS uh, sig signal, or is it only if I do SOS that people will join? All right, here's an egg right in the middle of the lake. That sounds less than ideal. Uh, I want to call in my gunnery. Make sure all is good. And uh, I was also told I should call in a resupply. What's the cooldown on resupply? Is it not long? Well, that's the inbound. I don't know what the cooldown is though. I guess I'll see in a second once it drops. 
they can join without the SOS. I, I believe it's set to do that, but I'm not even I'm not even too fussed. I was having to be perfectly honest with you, I was having some server problems. Oh, resupply cooldowns three freaking One second chat. Got some bugs here. Is that like a kill streak thing? Or is it just a kill tracker? Is that all that's happening? I don't notice any like XP bonus or anything. I know I gotta go around, I gotta collect samples, right? I gotta clear the heat maps. I can probably just reload my mag and... What is this anyways? This isn't a nest, right? This is something else? Is it a nest? I mean... That looks like a nest. So I'll just put that in there. <sighs> ready to liberate. Ready? <laughs> Who's ready to live? Oh no! No, 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 hold up. Wait a second. I had a gun. Is that the gun right there? I think that's the gun on the map. That grenade was way down low. All right. I'm actually offended that that killed me. That, gren that grenade. I should absolutely have not died. All right, I'm going to go down. We're going down to this. I thought I marked that. No. Oh, no. The last hell diver marked it. This one is like, I don't know where anything is. I just got here. <laughs> oh, it's gas, so it went boom a lot. Oh, no, 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 wait. Okay, right. I was gonna, I was about to say that can't happen because it was a frag grenade, but yes, it was a frag, but it caused an explosion, and then the explosion interacted with the gas, and then the gas caused a larger explosion. So you're correct, right? Yeah, there the was a, you're right. All right, so what is this? Big old nest. How do I- I'm guessing I just throw grenades in it to destroy it, right? Do I just call in? I could just call in my strike. Dude, I love how the aim is just absolutely all over the place. Oh, yikes, mate. Oh, no. Come on, I've already used one death. I don't want to do this already. Oh, so what I was going to say earlier is I know they just added that uh, personal mech suit thing, right? But I remember in the last game that they had like all sorts of vehicles. It, there was like, there was almost like speeders or something too. I, I'm assuming that's just something that they're gonna add with time, right? It's like not here yet, but eventually they'll, cause they just added that Patriot thing. Oh God. One second, let me catch my breath. Okay. Come on, one second. I'm faster than the bugs, right? That looks like no. That's... That's a no. Okay, just... <laughs> At the time, it's just the mech. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I, so that's kind of interesting. I wonder if they're eventually going to add all of the... Uh, I wonder if they're going to eventually add all of the stuff. So there's the Patriot exosuit. It's. I probably don't want to call it in yet, though. I don't know, though. We're off to quite the start here. Is that... These are bigger guys, right? I just want, to, like, a moment to catch my breath. That's all I'm asking for here. He's dead. Okay, good. I'll get my machine gun back, and then... I'd like to call an orbital strike. That grenade did not go uh, where I wanted to. What about this one? That looks close, right? It's right there. Okay, beautiful. All right, check my machine gun again. It's up here. There we go. Because I think I had a bit left. How many? Oh, this liberator is better. Yeah, that liberator has more uh, ammo than my other one. So we'll take this one. All right. Destroy the nest. Uh, use my big thing. Is this guy there? Oh, 
god, dude, that's gone so good. <laughs> Is Nightbot... I don't, know what I, I don't know what's up with Nightbot. I really just wanted him spamming messages. Definitely shouldn't be... Oh, shit, dude! Alright, call in, call in a thing. Call in a thing. Throw that. Go. Uh, excuse me. It's too many bugs. I think I should have picked an easier mission, chat. This is not... Am I out yet? I'm gonna go till I'm out. Because I know we throw away a magazine. Oh god, I gotta sit to reload. I mean, the get I get it, the gun's big and stuff, but come on. <laughs> I want to make this work, you know. I think I should call in ammo. I'm assuming kneeling does better. Resupply. There we go. I, pr I assume kneeling uh, increases accuracy, right? That's got to be the way of things. Wait till you get to at least difficulty six. Yeah, right. Well, I will not be doing that by myself. Solo challenge run. That's where we're at. Does it, uh, are these going to stay here for me? By the way? Alright, wait a second. Uh, 25 seconds for orbital strike. I, I could put down the machine gun sentry. What else do I have to clear on this map anyways? It's that one egg, and then, oh my god, that egg nest up there looks like a nightmare. I should, I, you know what I need to do? This is what I need to do. I'm messing around here, but I need to nade these nests so that no more, uh, guys come through. That's what I should be focused on. Fire in the hole. Excuse me, bug. I'm gonna toss that up there. Did I get You know what, actually, I should have titled this stream? E Evolution of a Gamer. Because what's going to happen is I'm st we're starting off, and it's it's tough, right? Like, I'm having a time. But by the end of the stream, I'm going to be soloing max difficulty. Nice game. Some nice effects on it. You know, you never know when, when you get games that start off in... Like top down or 2D and then they switch to 3D. You never know how that's going to go, but hats off to him. Hmm. Aim down sight swap and get more accurate. Is it like actually? Is it actually on the crosshairs at this point? I'd imagine there's still some sway, right? I feel like I'm playing Destiny. All right. Uh, I'm gonna check my resupply real quick, which was... Where is it? I don't see it. Can I just call on another one? In, in a few seconds. I think it was just up here. Let me go see if I have it. I got time. 30 minutes. We're gonna go around the map. We're gonna clear the heat maps. Finish the last of the eggs. I know I resupplied back here somewhere. There it is. There we go. Oh, man. So, okay, lesson learned there. You should completely reload your magazine before you interact with it. That way you get a fresh full. Does anyone know how many mags it replaces? Does it say how many mags it replaces? I found something. What did I find? Oh, here we go. Got a couple of things here. Captain's log. We got... This is going to be another super weapon. Oh, requisition slips. Okay, so some currency. We got some explosive barrels. It replaces all of them. Three to four, depending on the weapon, and two grenades. Okay. All right, cool. All right, next heat map is actually right next to me. 
Uh, so we will go clear this. I heard some dudes over here. There they are. They're just- are, is that like a roaming pack of enemies? It's probably best to clear them instead of, uh, just see what happens later on. Oh my god, dude, I do not want the ACOG right now, please. <laughs> I'd rather deal with the sway than have... Although it's good for this spot, right? Are these armored guys? No? Kind of? Semi-armored? That weapon's got some nice sound to it. Alright. Uh, this way. Next heat map. Crouching helps with... Uh, I, that would that makes a lot of sense. I kind of assumed as much, but... Oh, come on, bro! Where is it? Where is it? Uh, right, right up. That's easy. Throw it in. Boom. Got it. We got three more respawns, too. You know what's funny, actually? I remember now, in the first Helldivers, that I really loved playing that solo as well. Because, yeah, I remember- I remember thinking, alright, so- It's not the case anymore, okay? It, it's not the case right now, but I remember thinking, Should I move my camera? Because it's covering the map. Although, most of the time, that doesn't matter. I, I think it's fine. Because most of the time, we, we aren't even looking at the map. I'm going to go clear these eggs over here. So, so it's all coming back to me. It's been like 10 years, so get, give, me, give me a break. Also, it's a different game, but, you know, there's clearly some carry over here. But I specifically remember in the first game uh, getting pissed <laughs> whenever anybody would join my lobby. Because I, it, in my head, it was always like, this guy sucks he keeps dying and he keeps using up our what are they called reinforcements he keeps using up my reinforcements so i was always preferring to not have anyone in my join my lobby because i was like these guys just suck at the game and they're just going to keep on dying and then we're going to fail the mission because we've got no reinforcements left and it was always on it was on me to carry the whole thing now that's not the case right now can you just not do these without a mate then? Yeah, you just can't do the bunkers then without a duo, huh? There should be something in place, right? Where, like, you give me, you let me do it with, like, if I have, like, th I have, like, uh, two seconds or something to dive and quickly interact the other one. Yeah, you can't at all, you guys are saying? Okay. Well, th I think that's a shame. I think that should be changed for the people who do want to do the solo, right? And I should be actively calling in resupplies, because I have... Like, why the heck not, you know what I mean? Oh, I'm supposed to be going this way. Helldivers 2 is probably influenced by other games over the seven-year dev cycle. Oh, of course, right? That's all. So many games are so iterative, building on what came before them. And evolution. I mean, like I said, it's really cool to see them have, make a successful transition from camera perspective and type of game. Like, moving from a top-down game, twin-stick shooter, into this third-person shooter. Like, it's, it's, it's great to see, you know what I mean? Because I've seen other games try that before and not be as successful. Try to change, like, the format and the, and the style of game, and it just hasn't exactly worked out, but... I mean, clearly, given the... how this game has taken off, clearly it's working out for them. W were those meds? Do I get stim packs with resupply? Alright, let's go clear the heat map over here. I do get stims with resupply? Awesome. Oh, what am I doing, dude? <clears throat> I just realized I need resupply to uh, get some nades to kill the uh, 
kill the eggs we're going to. That's the egg right there. It's always those smokestacks. Okay. So grab two. And then there'll be two more here. I'm going to actually mark this. Okay. That way... Tagging map. East. On my position. Um, I don't forget where the stems are. And actually, let's just call in a orbital strike, and then get some bugs in the in the process too. Firing orbital strike. How'd you like to taste some freedom? Anyone else? Okay, there are. Another heat map this way. Get some! Get some! Enjoy your piece, you won't have it at higher levels. Oh, dude, I'm a. <laughs> trust me. <laughs> Wait a second. So, this is a bug breach. It's different from the eggs, though, right? I mean, I'm I'm gonna I, I'm generally curious in this thing to see like players who are then playing solo and pushing the higher difficulties. Like that's really that shit <laughs> will be really cool to see. Uh, okay, I think that bug breach is just temporary because it's gone now. Yeah, it's gone now. But we do have one right over here in this direction. Let's go grab that. Okay, the bug breachers are swarms coming out different from these the heat map ones. Yeah, yeah, like here's here it is. Oh no, the bombs! God, dude. Oh, no one's chasing me? Did I nade them all? I think so. I need to get another explosive to pop that, though. I'll grab my resupply. I got two more over here. <clears throat> you can use nade launchers to clear the bug holes from long distance. I don't- I'm pretty sure I haven't unlocked it, because I have just started. Uh, I'm pretty sure I haven't unlocked that yet, but that's good to know. That makes it kind of a no-brainer. You know what's funny, too? Again, it, the, the, uh, it's not surprising, but I do believe that is also a carryover from the original game. Because I seem to recall that as well, wanting some sort of an aid launcher. Although, I think I remember even using the exosuits, uh... This way. I think I remember even using the exosuits because they had explosives on them. Because there were different variations of the exosuits, if I recall. And there were certain ones that had, like, a grenade launcher, basically. And so you could just do that. Got some experience, got some requisition. The big one's up here, though. And this is, I think, the final thing for me to clear on, on this map. Uh, I think that's the last. Oh, no, there's a couple heat maps up there, but I can do the egg and then go clear those. Those should be small. So, okay, we'll do that. Plus, now they have mechs, which... Yeah, 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 yeah. Swan dive into a bug hole with a pulled grenade pin. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if I have enough respawns, sure, that's fine, but... <laughs> <laughs> that's funny, dude. Alright, I'm gonna orbital... I'm gonna go up to the big thing and orbital strike it, I think. Pretty sure it's off cooldown now. Where is the big... Oh god, dude, we are surrounded. This is actually... Yeah, pretty... Pretty precarious. Empty. 
Bug breach detected. Right there, okay. Uh, call it in, call it in, call it in. Right, right, up. Uh, throw it. Okay. It hit that thing, it, it sticks. It's a sticky nade. That's actually amazing. Wait a second, it didn't kill him? Excuse me? Did it not stick? Was I misunderstanding what was happening? I think so. <laughs> oh, these guys are big, dude. I mean, you're just screwed if you don't have armor piercing rounds, right? I keep forgetting that this gun is a Neil animation reload. Okay. Uh, here's a question, if you guys know. Is run speed affected by the weapon that you have, right? So when I've got my special giant gun out, is that a slower sprint speed? Or does it not make a difference? It is? You do think so? Okay, that's good. I just instinctively was swapping from the big weapon but I really wasn't sure. Dude, we still have like all of the nest here. I've done absolutely jack squat. Back out. Big boy here. Okay. Just gotta find the nest. It's those one, there it is, there it is. Okay, there's one. What do I got on my... Or oh, Orbital Strike is up! Firing orbital strike. No, I thought I had my gun out! One second. I need to call in another resupply really quick. Kinda wanna just throw a turret down. Oh, no, 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 I don't, I don't. Because I, I, my turret is one-time use, and I want to save that for uh, when I'm extracting, right? That's going to make the most sense. I will call in a resupply, though. So I know eventually, once you actually start playing a lot, like, you know the stratagem uh, co click combos by heart, and then you get good at being able to just toss them out and... What? I don't even know what happened. What killed me? Turret is not single use? Oh my god, you're right. Wow. Oh, I don't have my big gun. Oh, where is it? There it is. What's this? Supply container? Oh, samples, my samples. Reload this, reload the, uh, yeah, I'll reload this. Then my, my nade bounced on me. <laughs> mm. Yeah, of course it did. Great, wonderful. So happy about that. <laughs> All right. Let's see, we got uh, some nests over here. Uh, my thing's good. And you guys just told me that my sh machine gun is not one-time use. Oh, I mean, I can see it right there, yeah, because it's got the, the ones that are have... The ones that are, say, one-time use, so... If I just wait a second, that orbital strike might hit him. Nope. I'm so, oh, okay, it turned into a bug breach. I see. Well, that kind of sucks. And what are you guys doing? And why are you here? No, this is bad. Very bad. Oh, uh, how about my machine gun? How do I call? One second. 
Fuck, dude, why is the machine gun thing so complicated? Okay, here we go. One more resupply. We can do this. Alright, uh... I am gonna call in my machine gun. Okay. I'm gonna put it right here. I should have called it in quicker because I'm gonna die by the time it lands. Okay, here we go. Please, dear God, just survive. Just one more second. Stim up. Throw a grenade. Throw another grenade. Throw three grenades. Who gives a shit? And they're- Okay. They're- We're good. I think. Okay, I'm gonna call in a resupply. That's it? The machine gun doesn't stay? It runs out of ammo. Got it. That makes a lot of sense. Thank you, chat. How much more time? Oh, the machine gun's back up! Okay. We're good. Want to throw out another machine gun? That's a low cooldown. We're good. We're I'm, This is a, a learning process. I apologize if it's a little painful. But this is really good to know as a solo. Because I'm gonna just throw that. I'm just gonna throw this out constantly. That's my but. That's like that. That's my. That's my co-op partner. Is my machine gun. Oh wait, it says it's an eight-minute cooldown. Oh, Ugh, I'm an idiot, dude. It's the machine gun sentry that I was thinking about. So I just called in a machine gun, and I already had a full machine gun. All right, let's destroy these eggs. <laughs> let's just... I, I, okay, I get it. Shoot the eggs, right? I can figure that out. That's fine. Let's just shoot the eggs. You know how to do that, Dennis? Can you, can you figure that out? Shoot, point, point at the eggs and shoot them? All right, get some eggs here, shoot those. Well, you know what, if I've got a gun right there, well, no, I don't need to use it on these eggs. It's stupid. <laughs> mech is a global thing at the moment. Everyone has access to at least one. Oh, yeah, the big mech thing? Yeah. Because it's new, right? They're like, hey, here's this fun toy. But then eventually it'll probably be behind some sort of... You know, it'll be behind the level progression thing. Toss these nades out. I'll call in another resupply real quick. Oh, that's... Never mind. It's on cooldown. Machine gun sentry is back up. No. Where's the breach? It's right there. Okay, machine gun sentry. Throw that out. And I'm gonna toss out an orbital strike down that way. Okay. Machine gun sentry, go! Good job. That was good. Okay. I think I'm just- I think I'm gonna extract now, I'll be honest with you. I only have one thing left. And my supplies are running. I think I'm just gonna get- Like, I'm gonna just hightail it out of here. Move on to the next mission. Good thing to get used to early is mo uh, moving the stratagems to more convenient keybinds like arrow keys or mouse buttons. Oh, mate, I'm playing on PS5. <laughs> Honestly, that's even kind of a bummer because that was whole that was like half of the fun in the first game was dealing with the stress of having to enter those like freaking combinations while things are going haywire.
Time to mech it up. For this thing, yeah, I'm gonna call a quick resupply though, I will. And um, how is my big gun? Well, you know what, I don't need, oh. what was that? Alright. Reload the bad boy. Precision strikes here. We're gonna call in some help. And where is my extraction point, actually? This way? There we go. Dropping a pin. Okay. Next, 200 meters. Let's go. <clears throat> Am I all loaded up here? Oh, I can reload this real quick. Yeah, I'm just gonna reload this and then grab. Alright. Here goes. I've learned to run and call in stratagems on a controller. Oh yeah, I mean that's that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying though. That was like half of the fun of the first game was the stress of that. That you know what I mean? The stress of trying to do that. Where's my big gun? Aim it for this idiot. Oh my god, dude, that hurts. Are you kidding me? What did he do? Stab me in the chest? Can I mount this gun? Probably not, right? Oh, there's some stuff here, though. What is this thing? Terminal? Oh, that's to turn this gun on, isn't it? I'd like to do that if I can just... Can I try it real quick? All right, what's the code? What's the code? Come on, quick, give me the code. Come on, give me the code. Oh, it's just doing it automatically? Wait, why is it pointing up? Find. Oh, I gotta find the artillery. Is that it? I just walked by something. They literally just sidestepped my nade. That's unbelievable. Find ammo shells and load into artillery. Okay, there it is. So I'm just gonna walk this over here. And uh, I'm assuming this is probably not the depot. It's somewhere else, right? Oh, there it is, there it is. Just insert that real quick. My guy. This is a side mission? Fun, but will take you a long time? Oh, really? Bugs? Where is it? Where is it? These bugs. Don't mess around. Obviously. My guy. Do I still get anything? I did everything but extract. Well, I didn't do everything, but... Because there were still some heat maps that I didn't clear. Alright. We learned a lot. We're gonna go into the next mission. Much more educated. And focused. To deliver democracy, I'm excited. Extracting is optional? Well, like, I probably lose points for using up all my lives, though, right? I assume I- I assume I lose points. I'm gonna turn the volume up here real quick. Just a little bit. There we go. Okay. Alright. Personal order completed. Cool. We're good. You get more XP per diver extracted. Oh, really? How you liking the game? I mean, I've just gotten started. It, it's 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 a fun. It's been fun so far. I really liked the first one a lot, and it's cool to see them like take it into 3D. Uh, you know what I mean? Because the first one was well, I mean, it was like a 3D game, but it was top-down camera perspective. So it's cool for them to be like behind the back now. 
Uh, I want to check out some of these. Oh, this is just like my customization equipment thing. I, I guess I want to check out the uh, unlocks. I don't know how much I have for currency. The machine gun seems really good. I'm going to stick with that. Um, orbital barrage. I could buy that for a little bit. I could also buy the Eagle Str- Oh no. Which one do I have? Oh no, I don't have those. I don't have the funds. I, did, I just need to keep playing so I unlock more, really. Is what I need to do. Oh man, the Gatlin Sentry looks nuts, too. Eagle Airstrike is great. Uh, yeah, I need 4k. The straight, uh, oh, the strafing run, the airstrike does look better. I mean, yeah, right, because it's, it has less uses. It's only got two uses, but it looks like it hits a much wider area because this looks pretty narrow, the strafing run. All right, well, let's just go out and do some more. That's really what it's all about, right? So let's head back out. Really doesn't matter what planet, but I'll try a different one. I'll try the try the green one. Allied destroyer coordinates received. Initiating Allied destroyer has joined squadron. Oh, mate, this is not what I meant to do. I thought I was starting up a media mission myself. In before kicked. <laughs> You can oh 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 I see what you guys are saying about the eagle okay. Yellow boxes are new ops. The white ones are ones in progress that you can join. It's because I have to I have to cycle through with the bumpers. That's basically how it is. We'll try an easy again. That was hard. That's that was hard for some for easy. I'll be honest with you. I mean I am new, but still. That felt pretty hard for easy. <laughs> Alright, wow. A lot of heat maps here. I'm gonna start by the objective, and that way... I'm gonna start by the objective, right? And that way I can clear the heat map, get the objective done, and then, you know, I, I'll keep clearing heat maps if, if it makes sense. But if I'm running out of lives, maybe I'll go to extract. Am I game journalist? <laughs> oh, I see what you're saying. Right, because because of my skill my skill level or my lack thereof. Hey, I'm just getting used to playing a shooter on a controller again, you know what I mean? This is a throwback to like seven years ago. I haven't not used a mouse in a shooter in yes, it's it's probably been like seven years, like my god. It's a whole, it's a whole relearning process, that's for sure. All right, let's call in the gun. All right, and then we call in a resupply, I was told, because why not? Um, and you can top off your gun. And I guess that's good for now. I don't want to call in the exosuit. So, grab this. Boom. And grab some ammo, boom. Then we got supplies. This guy like having a hard time breathing. Just do that real quick. Difficult time. Seek medical attention. What's this uh SOS 
this beep in here. Oh, this is like a um, like a loot crate, or not a loot crate, but like a it's, something will pop out of it, right? So here's requisition slips. I've gotten like heavy weapons from that as well before too. All right, so we got uh, let's see, this way. My guy, look at that! You got a whole crew here, throwing stuff in, getting getting work done. It's time to spread democracy. Alright, we'll go this way for the heat map here. It was right this way, right? Yeah, yeah, right here. Okay. Call in a strike, I think. Bug out post requesting orbital strike. This will probably do it. It's like right there. Bada boom. Oh, I I saw that. You get like you get like little companion drones eventually, right? That's really sick. It's a tr oh my god, dude! It's a freaking <laughs> it's a freaking drone like carrying a laser gun. I suppose that makes some more sense than, I mean, well, wait, they do have ones with the real guns, but the laser gun should have, uh, not deal with the kickback, right? Of the kinetic weapons. Uses less battery power to shoot, probably. Well, actually, no, I imagine the, whatever energy source you need to fuel the shooting a laser would drain a battery. Maybe quicker than the restabilization of a kinetic one. He has to do... What the mlep? Oh. <laughs> the, the physics of the stuff bouncing all over the place. Alright, cool. Uh, this way. Stand in that building. Give you... give. Uh, wait. Uh, grenade the tower? Really? You're talking about this or something else? Wait, were you trying to get me to blow up my friend? Hey, listen, I know enough to know there's friendly fire in the game. So, what's funny, though, is that I swear nobody joined the last mission, but already we've had... We started out, and, all like, instantly we had, like, four people join this one. And I didn't change my settings in between. Not exactly sure what happened. Nobody was on the other planet. Oh, that's why? Interesting. Surprise. That's also kind of strange to me, though, because so many people are playing this game, right? So you would almost assume that there would be somebody somewhere on, on every planet. Is his thing done? He just got out of it. Can I get into his thing? Yeah. I probably probably shouldn't do that though. <laughs> Is that a nuclear explosion? Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> I mean I wanna I, I should just try the mech, dude. I don't even care. It's probably gonna have a decent cooldown uh call in time, right? There it is. Beautiful. All right. All right, so left and right trigger, I'm assuming. We got a thousand rounds on right. Spins it up, and then left trigger is missiles. Is there a sprint for this thing? Doesn't look like it. Do I knock down trees? Of course I do. I am a giant exosuit. Ooh, these aren't very... I love those little... <laughs> How far away am I from... Oh my god, excuse me, bugs! Do I need to call in reinforcement? Can I do it from in here? No. 
Oh, man. You know, I swear in the first game that you could call in while in an exosuit. I, cause, I, actually, I'm like positive you could. Because I remember being in an exosuit and like seeing the stratagem for a, a reinforcement, like just propel itself out from the center of it. I specifically remember that being a thing. But doesn't look like that works here. Unless there's a different key for pulling up the stratagem when you're in the uh, when you're in the exosuit. Wait a second. Was that our egg? Was that our? What was that? Oh, that was a drop off for someone else's exosuit. Okay, that's really cool. Someone's shooting a laser. Dude, it's so sick that our ships are up there and they're actually like you can watch them rain in the reinforcement artillery like that's actually dope as heck i'm gonna be honest with you i'm not just saying that i i know this is a sponsored stream i'm not but like that kind of like that 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 kind of thing creates so much immersion in games you know what i mean and like those are our ships that we go back to and then we then we drop off the ships on the planet and then you can literally watch the ship shoot a freaking giant laser beam down here like, it's hilarious. <clears throat> like, why was I using this when I was solo? I don't know what my problem is. I have such a, um... It's like the, it's like the potion problem in RPGs, right? Like, you never want to use... You want to save your potions for when you really need it. And then you end up never using your potions. You get to the end of the game and you have a thousand potions left. You know what I mean? I feel like that's how I am when I play games like this solo. It's like, oh, I really got to save. I got to save my mech until I really need it. And then I end up dying and never using it. <laughs> like, just use the mech. Just get in the mech. I should get in the mech right away. And then, like, we'll just walk around in it. And if I don't want to use the ammo, I can hop out of the mech and sh shoot some bugs, you know what I mean? Like, that's literally what I should be doing. My dude, Wilhel Wilhelm, was level 50. Nice, bro. Alright, I want to try a solo mission again. That was really fun, but I think I'll alternate. I think we'll do some solo and then some group, because in the group we learn a lot, but then it's just fun to do solo, even if it... <laughs> if it freaking is a, is a ball ache. <laughs> it's still a good time. It's a fun, uh, it's a fun challenge, right? That's what we'll say. I'm, I'm, can, I'm really trying to sell myself on this here, chat. You can switch from public to friends only in the settings. Yes, I did see that. I will do that. Pop out chat. That's what I was Another looking for. for Allied destroyer has left squadron. Welcome aboard, Helldiver. That is what I was looking for. The chat pop out. Solo gets rough around difficulty 5-6. Oh, don't worry, bro. I'm like difficulty zero, so. <laughs> All right. Uh Okay, of course, yeah. I mean, they don't want to be stuck with me. All right, so we go to my settings. I'm gonna change it uh, just to friends only, and then we'll do uh, we'll do we'll do one or two missions, and then I want to go back because it is cool to be with that big group and see all that stuff. But this stuff's also really. It really doesn't matter where I am. I liked that planet. I I, I should just check them all out though. Like, let's check out the desert planet, Erida Prime. This world is riddled with terminated abominations. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Faster than light. The exosuit is great, but it takes a decent pilot and coordination. At difficulty, 6 plus coordination is uh, much greater than gear. Yeah, I mean, just trying to not friendly fire, right? Like, that's like half the battle. And you know the other thing this is uh, uh, that I'm enjoying about this? You can not see these heat maps, huh? I mean, you can, but boy, it's 
a bit of a struggle. All right. Wilhelm, I think that was you. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but I'm assuming great job because the mission was successful, so way to go. <clears throat> Only low level has a few heat maps, right. Friendly fire should almost never be an issue, but some folks... <laughs> I'll tell you, dude, in the first game, it wasn't even friendly fire that was an issue. It was because because it was a top-down game and you only had so much screen real estate, I, you were constantly dropping stratag stratagems on your friends. Like, all the time. Or the other thing that always happened is I would I would call in a reinforcement when my mate died, and then the reinforcement would kill me when he dropped in. Like, that... Oh god, dude, the wrong one. I knew. Well, I mean, it's. I guess it's good. I'm just chilling here while I try to get in the thing that I actually wanted. Alright, let's check the map. Oh, you can see the uh, heat maps much better here. It was just on the uh, preview display that it was difficult to actually spot them. Alright, so we got one here. So we're gonna mark that. And I am actually not going to call in my thing yet. I think I'll call in my exosuit when I get to the actual objective spot. But for now, let's just chill with this. Yeah. It's like right here. Is it those smokestacks? Uh, I like saw some smokestacks just over the... Replenish my stamina real quick here. Old mod from Twitch to Zazu. Oh, hey there, man. Dude, remember when I streamed on Twitch? That was... Tough. It, it actually, I, you know... You, 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 people say that. People say this, but... Genuinely, feels like a lifetime ago. Since I did, like... Consistent Twitch streaming. Uh, I'm gonna call it an orbital strike. Here we go. These things suck, dude, when you're solo. All right, how's my uh, machine gun? Nope, not yet. Warning, you are the I know, but I'm trying to get away from the bugs. What is happening? Oh, the trem oh, tremor detected. Okay, is there a uh, sandworm? Are we on Arrakis? What's happening? You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Point me to the enemy. Hello? Okay. Alright. Grenade. Toss it. Please land. That, that That's a Kobe, right? Thank you. Is this a sniper rifle? Anti-material rifle, it is. That's gotta be great armor pen or whatever, right? I, I just like the machine gun, though, to be honest with you, so... I think we're just gonna stick with it. Oh, how's the Liberator? This one is... 7 of 7. Go with that. And we got some, uh... material here. Okay, we're golden. Yeah, dude, feels like a... intense heat. Stay in the shade. Feels like a lifetime ago that I did, uh, Twitch streaming. My objective is all the way up there. Let's clear this heat map. And then I will circle up to the objective. That's the plan right now. Yep, let's do it. I think I if I don't sprint... I haven't seen it yet, but so far from what I've seen, the unlocks are like getting new stratagems and stuff, right? Are there stat unlocks as well, though? Or is it all just like, here's new gear for you? Like, here's uh, a new, better version of the weapons and the stratagems and all of that? 
Um, but are there actually like, uh, so what I'm thinking is like faster stamina regeneration and stuff like that. Is that part of this game's progression or is it all just the unlocks? I should do this first. Much higher. Armors equal stats. Okay, so there's a there's a whole whole armor progression as well. That's cool. It's a nice bloom, huh? That's some good looking particle effects. I think I can call in my uh, thing here in a second. Big boy, yeah. Call it in, call it in. Call it in, call it in. Come on. These are just little guys. I don't need the, uh, I don't need my big gun on them. Those are the big guys, though. Mate, I kind of want my machine gun. Where is it? <laughs> never gets old. Uh, okay, we got a couple of whole uh, mess still. I think I missed that, bro. Bad, bad news. No, I got it. Good. Got. Great. Great. Will Dune be a good game in your opinion? I, I mean, it's kind of 50-50, right? Like, they, they show some cool things. It sounds cool, but it you never know until you get your hands on it. I do like what they're talking about with that game, though, right? Like, I think it looks pretty good. And it kind of doesn't... Like, it's honestly, my, my general sentiment on games nowadays is, like... Tagging map. Northeast, 200 meters. Learn about it as it's about to come out. Uh, hope it's cool. Learn about its systems. And then... If it doesn't end up working out, there's so many other games to play. Like, I, I see so many comments in when I do coverage of something where I'm just, ch like, learning about a game and just talking about it, f getting some details about it and sharing that in a video that I make, right? And I'll, I'll, I'll end up seeing so many comments that are like, dude, you gotta stop getting hyped. You're gonna be disappointed. It's like, my, the, the, my entire existence doesn't hinge on whether or not a video game is good or not. You know what I mean? Like... If there's a video game coming out and I'm interested in learning about it and I cover it, like, it's okay if that video game ends up being bad. It's not going to put me into shambles. Like, I'm not completely devastated. You know what I mean? Like, I, I, I just don't really get the sentiment that, like, if... Uh, okay, grenades bounce. I learned that earlier, but now I'm really seeing it in action. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I I take I have no issue with like being interested in getting excited about video games. I'm not talking about blind hype where like I don't, you 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 don't pay attention to any f red flags that I show up prior to release, and then you just make sure you pre-order as soon as possible, and then it's airdropped into your freaking console or computer, like in instant automatic download, charge out of your bank account without a thought. I'm not talking about that, but like. You can, like, just look forward to shit. Like, it's okay to look forward to stuff. And if stuff doesn't pan out, that's okay, too. That's life, bro. I always assume that what I'm planning does isn't gonna pan out. And then if it does pan out, awesome! Like... What is this? What the... What is this thing? Alright, clearly I picked up a gun. It's a Tesla cannon or something? I mean, you test a lot of games. That's accurate. Machine uh, turret. What? Oh, God. Is this living? No. Petrified. Died long ago. Okay. Another heat mat right up here. So, I don't know what I picked up. Is there a way for me to tell? You guys will probably know, right? But... I'm calling a resupply in a second. I'm gonna need to. I need, um... I don't have any nades to pop that. Hold to charge and fire an arc thrower. Yeah. 
Can I? Oh, it doesn't. So what I was hoping there is that when I swapped weapons while I was charging, that it would drop the charge and not waste the ammo, but it actually ended up dispelling it. Or whatever the word is. Discharging it. <sighs> I think I'm actually going to toss this thing in there. It's way slower paced, obviously, when you play solo, especially, like, when you're new like me. But I kind of like this. It's like its own thing. It was the same, again, I, I keep saying this, but so there's so much, like, uh, consistency here from the first one as well. Like, missions took way longer. You can blow up your own sub reinf- <laughs> Of course you can. That's- this whole game is about self-sabotage. So I don't know why I'm acting surprised here. Is, that is not doing what I- it's not actually doing anything. It's because I'm not aiming. <laughs> this is just- this is a great- like, you guys must be super impressed. I can only imagine the looks on your faces. <laughs> I- I- I was not- using that gun properly. Okay, so my resupply thing, I just destroyed if you happen to miss it. I'm gonna call in an orbital strike in the middle of these two things. They're spread kind of far apart. I'm just curious about the radius and if this will work. I'm actually assuming this is not gonna work. It did not work, yeah. My assumption was correct. It did in fact not work. It, it did not have the radius. I want to squish that piece of crap. Didn't happen. Ready to liberate. Uh, okay, there they are. All right, uh, I'm gonna get my machine gun again. I was not, I was not working that thing properly. The uh, the the last the Tesla gun. Oh, the ammo still ended up dropping. Okay, well that's good to know. So I will go. I'll, I'll go get it. I mean, as a starter special weapon, this thing is, like, bomb. It absolutely shreds, dude. Alright, let's see here. My ammo should be here. Yeah, chat? Oh, there it is. It's right there. Awesome. Uh, perfect. Okay. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're good. How's my orbital strike doing? It's 25 seconds. We got the Liberator. I'm I'm, ref I'm full of these ammos. Oh, samples. You do drop your samples. Alright. So, we are gonna toss a grenade in. And then toss another grenade in. Blow up. These guys are literally... It's because they're fast enough that you can't... I, I can't, like, easily outrun them. And, you know, while playing solo, I don't have like, assistance along the way, so. Alright. I thought I was picking up ammo. I was- I'm blowing myself up. What is- what is this supposed to be? There is ammo there. Maybe because I'm maxed out. That's probably what's happening, right? So if I reload this, then I can pick it up? Yeah, exactly. Alright, uh... Main objective, let's do that. Upload escape, uh, upload escape uh, things. Oh, there's a heat map right next to it. Let's do that first. Let's do that first. The hunters, is that what they're called? Yeah, they're a pain in the ass. They are a pain in, they are, they are a big pain in the ass. All right, we got some big bugs. Um, kind of wanna, let's throw up a machine gun. Throw it right up there. Okay, do, do some work, please. No, 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 don't shoot. God damn it, dude. Tremors? 
<clears throat> All right, we're just throwing in the big boy. What's this? Activate terminal? Down there? Okay. No, 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 no. Please! No, what are you doing? Throwing grenades. One second. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Stop. Chat, one second. I can't talk to you. Like, what is happening? There's no nest or anything. My arm is broken. Okay. My life for super art. I need, I need, uh... What else do I got? Anything? I mean, I could do the exosuit. It's too early, right? No, this is what happened last time. This is what happened last time. I need to just... Well, let me just clear these guys. What do you mean? All right, don't, uh, don't, just give me one second. One second. Idiot. <laughs> uh, it's just too silly. Have a taste of democracy. I am enjoying myself, yeah. A tremor. All right, here we go. I gotta remember to reload all my guns before I do this. This keeps happening to me. Also, I think I gotta get rid of that pistol as soon as possible because I am absolutely never using that thing. It's coming. It's coming across as completely useless. I mean, it's probably fine, but. <clears throat> all right. So terminal activated. Now what? Up. <laughs> That's all I get to do. I was waiting for like, I was like, all right, there's got to be more. Pay attention. And it's just the one. That's funny. <clears throat> all right. All right. If I hear any bugs, I'm throwing down the sentry. That's the plan. Pistol's a goat later. Am I? Am I waiting? I think I'm waiting. Yeah, I think something's happening. I think we're just waiting. There was a progress bar down here on this machine, wasn't there? Yeah, there it is. Can I do it again? Align the tower. Up. Oh, God, what? Oh, R1. Okay, let's try this again. R1 to relate terminal text. Huh? Oh, chat. What am I doing? How do I move it? The joy the pads aren't doing anything. What do I do? Go to the tower and turn it. Oh, the actual tower. I see. Good call. What am I What am I aligning it with? I think that might be it. I heard a beep. There's the bugs. Okay, we good? Bug breach. Where is it? Son of a. Uh, I got it. I got it. Ready, boys? More? Any more? No? Activate. Mission map updated. Hey, you know what? That was pretty good. I'm starting to feel good. I'm starting to get the hang of this. 
All right, let's see. Where to? Uh, there's a heat map right there. I guess I should just do it real quick. And then, um, is this extract? Isn't that where I... What is this? It says upload escape pod data. That's what I just did. Is there another one? There's something else, I think. Oh. Use upload data stratagem to begin upload. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it's just, just a, it's a different mission type. Oh, shoot. Uh, are there going to be bugs? There's probably going to be bugs, right? I'm getting ready to call in the Patriot thing. Now, you know what? I'm just going to do it ahead. I'm just going to do it so I'm prepped. So I don't have to try to do it while bugs are coming. Okay. Go in. Alright. Just don't, just don't even, all right? I don't want to hear it. Okay. <laughs> Fucking unbelievable, bro. Absolutely unbelievable. Where's like, is there, uh, I'm gonna call it a machine gun. Uh, my resupply, oh, you know what? There's some supplies here, so I'll, I will grab this. And then pick up this ammo, and we'll see. Oh, it does fill. I wasn't sure it, uh, if it would fill the heavy. Someone left their tools there. Who cares? Nah, bro. I'm out of here. All right, I'm not. You guys stay over there, okay? Don't even. Well, I have my thing. The exosuit is completely done. I'll have my machine gun sentry that I can drop down. And I should just. I'm, uh, I might just do that right away. Get those samples. Ah, oh, man. <sighs> From where I died earlier. I don't remember where it was, though. Is it on the map? Is this it? You're telling me, should I really go get those samples? The vial icon? Okay. Fine. I'll do it. I'm assuming it's worth it, right? Okay, vial icon, vial icon. Let me see. Uh, there it is. Okay. Alright, here we go. 200 meters. I wish we, I wish I had like a machete or something, you know? Alright. I'm going back for it. You got your mech still? No, I blew the crap out of that, dude. It's 
Stop it! Yeah, I absolutely demolished my mech, so... Devs are fooling around the idea of adding melee weapons. I think it'd be pretty cool, right? Add more uh, play styles to the game. I mean, it doesn't have to be, right? Like, shooting and ordinance is still gonna be the thing. I don't- you know what? No, I'm sorry. I'm just extracting. This is already a nightmare. The bugs to spray orange smoke up are calling reinforcements. If you kill them before, there won't be a bug breach. Okay, that's good to know. Ooh, a flamethrower. I think we'll queue for another normal group game. Maybe do one more solo, but... Uh, okay, this is about to come in. I want to put my turret up here. Sending down sentry. Sending down equipment. <laughs> Great. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. That was, uh, I mean, you know, should have expected it. <laughs> because of course, right? You're calling in something from orbit. Like, obviously it's gonna blow the crap out of any building. Now this is where I would have wanted my, are these explosive? That's unbelievable that they're not, I'll be honest with you. given everything else in this game is. Yeah, dude. Hunters are unbelievable. What's the call-in for the... I've got like nothing. Gonna call in a strike and see what happens. I need to go get my machine gun because I don't think I can kill the armored guys without it, right? Can I kill the hunters without it? These things are unbelievable. I can kill them. Frickin'. Where's my mach machine machine guns over here? Oh, we got some samples too. This is Pelican One. I have visual on the extraction zone. Don't have the samples now. Pelican One, landing in progress. Still got my grenades. Watch out, Dennis. One second, chat. Okay, I got this figured out. Don't worry. What is that? Oh, that was the Pelican? Alright, I'm gonna make it. We're good. I actually still can't believe that those, uh, barrels aren't explosive. The machine gun doesn't pen armor, just has a lot of bullets and such. The big one? Really? Like, the specialty weapon doesn't pen armor? I know the- I know the basic weapon doesn't. But does the specialty one really not? You gonna play Dragon's Dogma 2? Oh, of course. Looking forward to it. <clears throat> yeah, absolutely, that's gonna happen. Hey, if you guys haven't yet, for some reason, either, check out, uh, check out the Helldivers 2 link. Help support the stream. Thank you. Much appreciated, much love. Easy no-brainer of a one to do, right? Because 
This game is, uh, people are loving it. I mean, I'm really, I'm really liking it so far. And I'm not ter terribly surprised. Frankly, the reason that I haven't gotten started yet is because I've been so busy with Last Epoch. Uh, that is winding down, though. I'm gonna have probably one more video on Last Epoch. I look ridiculous right now. Looks like I got a triangle head or something. <laughs> perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can unlock anything. Um, I know we can get guns and stuff. Those are the stratagems. So that's for the specialty guns. What about unlocking my base gun? Do I want to do that over here? <clears throat> Machine gun has medium pen. Stalwart only has light pen. Okay. So, let's see. Hello, auch. You can buy more weapons with the war bonds. Oh, that's the war bond system? All right. So how much do I have? I have 31. I can purchase the Punisher, which is a shotgun. And then there are different pages. These are locked though, probably on progression. Yeah, spend eight more medals. To, oh, spend eight medals and that brings me to that one. And then there's the second one too, right? Um, This is an assault rifle. I have the money for this. Should I buy this one, chat? I can buy, not both of them. I can buy the pistol or the liberator concussive. Any recommendations? <laughs> Punisher isn't great and Redeemer is the best sidearm. This pistol is amazing. The Senator. Someone told me the Redeemer is the best sidearm. I don't, uh... Stay in the first one for now. Punisher for sure. Buy this for sure. Okay, I'll try this one then. Alright, I'll do that. I'll do this. Oh, that's easy. It's only four. Purchased. Equip. And this is super credits? Okay. I'm sure once I need them, maybe I'll spend some. All right, all right. Well, I'll just stick with that for now. So then I must have, uh, it will show up here, right? Okay, so this, I got the shotgun now and I've got the secondary. All right. This place is liberated. I wanna go to non lib oh, wait a second. Oh, this is only 1% liberated. Oh, this one's cleared. Okay, earlier when I was playing, this one was like 99% liberated or something. So once it is 100% liberated, it's just not even, they don't even let you. Can you even still go if you want? No, yeah, it's 100%. So now we gotta push through this. Yeah, this is like the community progression stuff, right? I'm pretty sure they had this in the first game, although I don't exactly recall if it functioned the similar way where the community builds up a progress bar and then moves forward. But I know they had like a, a global map or uh, whatever, star map like this or something uh, in the first game as well. All right, uh, let's see. Oh wait, this is where we were anyways. Uh, I kind of want to go back to Meridia. And um, we'll go back to being able to group with people too. It, it I mean, it definitely seems that's it's the way to go, so. Go back and land on Meridia. Absolutely challenging, absolutely not. I want to make sure that I'm actually getting people. Another step. Initiating FTL jump two. Before I uh, bump up the difficulty. Because if I bumped up the difficulty and then nobody joined, it'd be a big rip. FTL jump successful. Hellpods prime. Mission coordinates locked. In I go. And I'm just gonna drop in if people join, great. If not, whatever. All right, I'll start over here. 
Uh, I don't want to start on the heat map, so we'll start over here. I, I, you know what I need to do? I should go and buy, because I, I have one more slot that I could fill. Reload anytime time I'm not shooting with the shotgun, because it reloads one round at a time? Okay. I feel like... I might regret the shotgun when it comes to clearing the waves of small guys, but maybe I should just use the pistol for that. Let them come. Let them brawl. Let them face the insurmountable Grenades. might of the hell. And common sample. Is the map the same every time per the planet, or is it procedural uh, landscape, like the terrain? I'm assuming it's procedural with points of interest Top just popped on, minutes. right? Eliminate the commander somewhere within that vicinity. It is procedural, okay. Yeah, I mean, I guess I can SOS to guarantee eight people join or increase probability, right? SOS, and uh, I almost forgot. But we want to do this, and then do this, and that's good. Sixty cap for the shotgun, or is there more? Sixty of sixty. Okay. And then my big boy gun. Okay. Let's see. Wait a second. Pistol is five of five? Why is that so low? Really? 25 rounds? Oh, no, no. The clip is more than... That's the number of clips, but there's more shots than five. It is one-shotting these bugs on this difficulty? Bro. I can't... I, I can't believe it. I cannot believe those, uh, what are they called? Hunters? Point me to the enemy. No, point me away from the enemy. Such a yikes. All right, just back off, back off. Everybody back off. I got a bomb. Get out. Max empty. Like the taste of freedom? I don't think the bugs are too scared, bro. C chill with the machismo here. <laughs> all right, great. I got the library card. I can go read a book. That's about, that's about all I'm good for. I'll go read some books for a while. Rethink my uh, enlistment. Hold reload to customize the way the weapon works. Someone, I'd seen that before. Yeah, I don't want the, I don't actually want the flashlight. This thing, there's nothing there. Anything for the big gun? Changing the RPM. Maybe lower it so I don't blow through ammo. Fire's a little slower, yeah. I actually, I don't want the light because, um, in sometimes when there's a lot of like fog effects, it actually makes it hard to see. I noticed it's one of the first things I shut off. Okay. So I think we're good. Well, you know what I mean? I think I'm good to progress. That's what I'm saying. This way, let's get a, uh, let's close up one of these. Close up one of these holes. Got two over there. Orbital, I can orbital strike on these idiots. Firing orbital strike. Does, does he get hit with that? There's no way, right? Oh, that's a big guy. There's a big guy right there. Did I not pick medium difficulty? What is happening?
bro. These guys are... Can you just... Are you dead? Are you dead? I think he's dead. Oh, that's the guy. That's the guy. Look at that. Expertly. I, he still called it in. Someone told me if I killed him, that wouldn't happen. I called it an SOS, right? Did I not change the settings? I think I might have not changed the settings. I'm pretty sure I didn't change the settings. So the SOS did jack shit. Okay, Dennis. Here we go. You know how to play video games. I've been playing them for at least a couple of years. Bug out post spotted. Prepare to exterminate. I mean, it's seriously ridiculous. Those hunters are really good. I feel like I'm playing, uh, I feel like I'm playing, um, Gears of War right now with a no look over the shoulder headshots. <clears throat> it's a really small window for killing them. Mm. Oh, big gun. Yeah, yeah. Let me reload this real quick. All right. Uh, mission accomplished. I gotta look for the brood mother. It's gonna be somewhere. I guess just go here and start clearing stuff. I heard a beeping. I'm assuming that's... Oh, is this it? This is it. This is it. Found something. So, credits? Oh, one second, chat. I'll be right back. Okay, hello. I return. What I miss? Fortunately, not a bug breach. Oh, another one of those, huh? You know what? I'm glad I started using the pistol because this is surprisingly way better than I expected. It's actually one-shotting the little bugs, oh, you know, on this difficulty, I'm sure. <laughs> actually, that is a good question. Does the, um, does the monster, like, health, does enemy health and stuff scale with the difficulty, or is it just the numbers? Like, how many certain, uh, can I put a bomb in that? Fire in the hole. There you go. Just the numbers change? Okay, so like the... Here. So the thing... So like, you'll still one-shot the small bugs then, even on the harder difficulties. Enemy types and numbers, okay. That's good. I uh, Frankly, I think that's the way to do it, so... Rather than just like health sc uh, scaling everything. Alright, let's see if we can find the Broodmother. That's why team coordination is bigger than weapons. Makes sense. Yeah, especially when you get like huge numbers of monsters, uh, of the bugs that are jumping all over the place, and then the super armored ones, and I'm sure there's all sorts of crazy stuff. 
I think one thing I've noticed is I keep and I keep uh going into fights like with no stamina, which is obviously not good. Can I pop these to hurt them? I don't know if that did shit. Also, I think I just blew through two mags by reloading unnecessarily. Last reload. For prosperity. Mate, dude. Okay. Thought there were some big guys over here now. I miscalculated. Alright, resupply then. Yeah, because I blew through my ammo. Has he died to his own turret yet? No, but I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> now that you br now that you bring it up. Oh, 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 something's happening. My turret found somebody. No, 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 stop it. I cannot with those guys. Is this the brood? This looks big. Is that the brood mother? Orbital strike. I'm assuming that's a brood. Come on, stay, stay, stay there, stay there! It wasn't even necessary. Alright, whatever. I mean, better that than the alternative, so... I'd rather an unnecessary orbital strike than a... ...necessary, but wasn't used orbital strike. Alright, this way. He's got his own little... ...clicking sound. I wasn't sure what that was before, but that was clearly the sound of the Brood Commander. That's the name, not the Brood Mother. Tactical asset near your location. Cat, now is not the time. You can stay in this room. <sighs> Cat's knocking on the door. Okay, here we go. One second. And you know the best part, of course. Now that I've opened the door and let the cat out, the cat will then knock on the door to come back in. Because it's not about... It's not about the room that they actually want to be... That, that they're in, or not. It's that they want the option. Oh, this is the side mission? I kind of just... I'm, I think I'm just going to go and complete the main. I want to open up my lobby again. I didn't realize that I kept it close. I'm pretty sure I, d I had not opened it up to public um, when I started this mission, so. Somewhere. There she. Wait. No? Is that her? There's a volcano happening? Okay, so watch out for the volcanoes. Got it. Samples. Boom. And am I a machine gun here? It is. Is that the brood mother? 
What is that? Is there nothing there? Oh, it's, uh, it's freaking, I'm seeing things, dude. Oh, cancel reload by pulling up strategy menu. Is this PS5 exclusive or PC? It's on both. I need to I need to need this real quick. I'm tired of these. One. How many are over here? Two. Breach detected. Awesome. Where is it? Right there. Uh, orbital strike. And then re, uh, resupply. I'll call resupply real quick. Anyone survive that? Yeah, everybody survived it. Great job. Okay, what do I got? I think we're... I think we're good. I haven't found the last broodmother yet, though. Yeah, I'm on PS5 right now. Yep. That the, I think that's got to be the broodmother. I heard her over here. Yeah? Page, call the Patriot in? Let's do it. This time, I promise not to blow myself up. Okay, just gotta get in the back. And all I need to do is not use the rocket at my feet. That was my fatal error. Pointing the, uh, pointing my gun down and shooting an explosive ordinance mere meters in front of my vehicle. See, that was close. I assume I was close to exploding myself there. You're not the broodmother, huh? Do I get a health bar on this bad boy? Or does it just blow up when it feels like it? Where is the broodmother? She's down this way? She migrated south for the season. Warmer weather. I can see the sun's down there, so don't blame her. <laughs> Blowing yourself up is known as the whole razzle dazzle. It starts smoking. Okay, so we got visual indicators. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. All right, let's head this way. I still got plenty of rounds. Vehicle's not smoking. I think we're good. Of course, I keep walking over these things. I don't know if I can get up this. Can I just shoot them? Kind of just want to. Oops. Sorry about that. Four more rounds. I'll chill out on that one. Should I pop this nest, though? That did not work. Damn it. What if I... Oh my god, bro. There's a breach up. I only got three more, uh... Explosives here, so... I feel like I'm wasting a lot of ammo. You know what? I just get out. Just get out. Just get out of the thing. Call in a machine gun. Sentry. Buy some time here. You will never destroy our way of life. That's I just didn't, I don't want to use my my gun on the little dudes. 
cannot believe I can't find this Broodmother, though. I'm going to toss another one in here, over here. Oh, dude, come on, bro. I'm going command, ship command, okay? Just give me a second. Like, uh, okay. Broodmother. It says she's right nearby. Or, I don't know, it doesn't actually show her exact location, but. If I just ping her location, that'll work? It'll follow her, or? <sighs> That's like full, really? Almost. All right. Good, good, good. We're good. Okay, so can I can I ping on her? Dropping a pin. East, 50 meters. I just don't know. Is that her exact location? Because I thought it was just I thought it was just showing where she was roughly. Oh, you can see the red dot. Well, those are just the heat maps. Right? Maybe I'm wrong. If you get close enough, her position becomes precise. Oh, is that it? I just saw a red dot. She must be right here, right? No? No, no, those are other red dots. Elites are the big dots, okay. I feel like she must have had to, headed north. I could be wrong though. We'll take a look. Yeah, I'm gonna be really interested to see if they add some of the other vehicles because I do remember there being like really fast vehicles in the first game. Brew Commander playing hide and seek. Yeah, seriously. A pin. West, on my oh, oh, what's all this? Oh, these little idiots. Yeah, playing the solo stuff is interesting, but it's definitely clearly better if you, like, clearly if you play with a group, you like, well, for one, you get shit done faster, right? So. I'm just going to go to the big heat map and assume that she's in there. Can I step on these idiots? Yes. Good. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the big heat map straight south and assume that she's just in there. Let's do that. Randoms can be fun as hell or- well, <laughs> so I, I said this earlier, but when I played the first game, I just always remember it. I mean, it's not surprising, right? But it's just such a gamble playing with randoms in a game like this where it's like 100%. It's like 110% friendly fire. 
So when you play with randoms, that usually means... That's literally all I had to do. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Alright, let's walk up to the extraction point here. <laughs> That's too funny. Random gives uh, randoms give a higher chance of friendly fire deaths, which is really the point of the game. True, right? Well, and you know when you're just like when you're just like kind of goofing off and you're playing on the easier modes, it's kind of whatever, right? Because who cares? But I would imagine it like if if people are playing like hyper seriously and you're on the harder difficulties, at that point you probably don't want to play with randoms. Because, you know, there's like a billion enemies every, everywhere, so every single death counts that much more, right? You really need to preserve the, your reinforcements, so I totally get it, right? But yeah, I mean, if you're, if you're just playing for fun and you're goofing off in the medium and lower difficulties, yeah, totally. Play with whoever. Usually people on higher difficulties have more trigger discipline as well. So that's true too. And then at that point, it's just a question of like, are you dealing with any trolls that are just there to literally make your life difficult because they think it's funny. So I'm, I don't have my explosives, but I might just be able to chill in here. I'm gonna um, plop down a turret and then jump in my thing. Let me get, uh, I actually don't need ammo. Well, I can pick up the ammo. Will this give me grenades or only the ammo from the resupply? I think only the ammo from the resupply. All right. So I'm going to call in a turret. And then I'm going to do this. And, and then I'm going to get in my guy, my machine. There we go. And I guess I'll call in a resupply. Just in preparation, I can run up and grab it when I need nades. But, um, otherwise, let me sit in this bad boy and st stomp on things. Can I stomp on these guys or only the, oh, only the small ones? I, I can stomp, I can step on these tiny guys. Less than one minute. Can't, can I stop? I can stop on these guys. Yeah, it's only the medium sized ones and above, presumably. Where's the countdown? Oh, there it is. One, one, uh, 112. Try melee with mech? No, nothing's happening. I mean, on this difficulty. It, 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 apparently, I can just step on most of them. I'm actually kind of bummed that I can't call anything from inside of my mech. Because in the first game, it, 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 it did, I do recall now, you were absolutely able to um, shoot out stratagems from inside the mech. Because that was like my whole playstyle, I remember, just sitting in the mech, like, as much of the match as... I would, I would open up the mech at the start of the match and just sit in it. And then you just throw out stratagems, you'd put down a turret, you'd put down... Um, when you were playing with friends, you'd, you'd call in their, uh, their reinforcement drops. All while running around in the mech, but you can't even pull up the strategy menu right now. A module that unlocks it later? Yeah, yeah, that would, that, that would probably. And also, like, uh, in the first game, they had a bunch of different mechs there, and there were, there were different kinds of, like, vehicles that you could be in. So that's also something that I assume that they're just, as, as Helldivers 2 progresses, they're gonna add that stuff over time, right? That'd make a lot of sense anyway, so. <clears throat> and there we go. Well, uh, this has been a lot of fun. I think we're gonna wrap it up for the afternoon, but thanks for coming out and watching me play a little Helldivers. I know it was a little late to the party, but, um, been meaning to get around to it anyways. Uh, thank you to PlayStation for sponsoring this stream in particular, but, uh, this has been a nice surprise of a game. Obviously, I'm, I, it, you don't need me to tell you about it, right? The... This thing's just been blowing up over the weeks since it released. And um, I really like, it makes me really happy because I really did, I really liked the first game. 
but it what it didn't nearly it didn't get anywhere near the success of, that this one has. I don't am I gonna make it in this thing, dude? I don't even know. Just just dive, just dive in, dive in, keep going. No, go go in. Go, there you go. Um so it's cool to see, right? First game came out, did well enough that they worked on a sequel for many years. This thing came out and just blew up. And I think they've done a pretty good job here of adapting what was a top-down twin-stick shooter into the third person. And it, it's so funny coming back, like, because all my memories are from the original game. Because I've just kind of started on the sequel. But it's so funny, like, how things come back from that game that have carried over into this game. Because uh, there's definitely a lot of crossover um, between the two. They've definitely inherited a lot of uh, a lot of what they did in the original. But, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, thanks for checking out the stream. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, check out the link there. Uh, I think I can I can just paste it because the bot is a little slow. Uh, check out the link if you want to give Helldivers 2 a look. It is right here. Here's the link. That's the link for the stream. Support the stream. Give me so they check your they check the click through rate or something. See how many people click the link. So click on the link if you want to check out Helldivers 2. You can do it that way, or you can just click on the link to uh, to help brother out. Either way, thanks for coming by the stream. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be doing some more streaming in the coming weeks for, uh, for some things. We got some releases coming up that I'm going to be checking out. Um, maybe even do a Dragon's Dogma too. I'll probably do a review of that uh, depending on how early we get the codes. But I might do some streaming of it as well. And um, yeah, anyway, thanks for hanging out with me. Hope you guys enjoyed. Helldivers 2, pretty cool game. I'd, I'd say so. All right, take it easy, guys. I'll see you later. Have a good one.